In this lesson, we'll continue our review of Math Test 10, Section 3, No Calculator. We're on questions 8 and 9. All right, let's take a look at problem 8. In the figure above, point B lies on AD. What's the value of 3x? So you really want to get in the habit on these math questions of circling the call of the question, right? Because it's not always just solving for x. Sometimes it might be 3x. Sometimes it might be a times b or a plus b. And as traps, they a lot of times the the answer choices would just have a. And so just it's it's um, you really want to pay attention so you don't make silly mistakes. All right, so we want 3x, and we see that this is a 90, right? And so this must be 90 as well, and it's a line. And so let's get the, we know that the, all the x's together, we've got 2x plus 2x plus x, so that's 5x equals 90. And so x, right, so let's say 10x equals 90, that'd be, that'd be 9, so 5x is going to be twice that, it's going to be 18. So 3x is just going to be 3 times 18, and that is 54. So the answer is C. All right, and one more question on this page. Let's go back and do number nine. Which of the following is an equation of line L in the xy plane? All right, my battery is a little good to know. So we want to get this equation, and the first step is find the slope. And so let's get a couple of points on this line. Always look for points that are right on. Um, easy to tell. So I know this is a point that I can tell easily. So that is going to be negative 4, 0. That's one point. And then here, this is another point. See, I don't want points at the middle because you have to estimate. So I'd, like a point like this would be good or this. I'll just pick 0, negative 4. All right, so change in y over change in x. Doesn't matter which way you go, just be consistent. So let's just go this way. So change in y, 0 minus negative 4 is going to be plus 4. Negative 4 minus 0 is negative 4. And so the slope is negative 1. And you should be able to see this looks like it, it's definitely downward. and looks like a 1 to 1 downward slope. And so to start the equation, we want y equals negative x, right? Downward slope. And then what's the y-intercept? It's negative 4. And they don't always have it in this form here. So if you look at the choices, which one looks like they have the x's and y's on both sides. So that's, I'm going to move the x over, add an x. I get y plus x. All right, so that's just another form of this. The answer is C.